and subscribers welcome back to my channel welcome back to another great video guys in today's video we're gonna do some barbie fried chicken we're gonna do some macaroni and cheese so it's gonna be baked macaroni and cheese and i hope you guys continue to support the channel continue to like the outdoor cooking so to get the morning started off now go wash off the chicken with some vinegar and I use about two cups of vinegar wash off the chicken get rid of the rawness so I have a season up the chicken now so I'm going to use some garlic powder some barbecue season and I am going to use some pimento seed I am going to crack the pimento seed before I I add them into the chicken so I'm using some scallion some ginger some onion and one green pepper so we're adding in the season Can you see guys? So I'm adding roughly one teaspoon of all purpose season. So we have a rubbing the season now. are going for the barbie fried chicken of coconut milk to marinate my chicken as well so it's like a wash I'm making for the chicken so whenever time the chicken is ready to fry I'm just gonna take it out of this and dip it in the flour Guys, may I catch up a fire here now? Start doing my cooking. Guys, so this is the flour. I'm going to dip the chicken in there to fry. So I'm adding one tablespoon of all purpose season in the flour. I 
and I'm adding one green pepper it's a scallion just to add some flavor in the cooking oil so I'm just waiting on the oil to hot before I start put the chicken in the oil Starting to fry the chicken now. Just gonna take out the scallion and the pepper. So I'm going to add one more piece in the pot. Not putting too much one time. Guys, today is gonna be another great outdoor cooking. As I grew up seeing my mother cooking outdoors, trust me. Those were one of the best days. Guys, can you see that? Barbie fried chicken looking good in the pot, guys. So we are checking on the chicken. Can you see that, guys? We are getting good color. So we are just turning them now. I am taking out this set. And I'm going to put in a second batch of my chicken. I am putting in the second batch now guys. the last piece so the second set of chicken looking real good just like the first set and they are coming along very good I'm just turning them and they are catching a beautiful color as you guys can see do a cooking always epic cook outside so in the next five minutes I'm gonna take all these three piece so I am going to take all the next set now They're looking real good and then I'm gonna make the barbecue sauce for them but I am gonna use some guava so I'm gonna blend the guava and add in the bob in the honey barbecue sauce that I'm gonna use so guys I'm gonna take you with me to the guava tree and come back so I'm gonna take off this Guys, we are going to the guava tree 
to see if we find any guava on the tree so I'm taking a guys with me just to see if we find any we are picking some ripe guava just to make the sauce for the barbecue fried chicken so I'm picking this one two so we have three of them now So here's another one. So we are back from the guava tree. So I am going to wash them and then cut them. So I'm gonna use them to make the sauce. I'm done cutting up the guava so I'm gonna add half cup of water guys to blend out the guava so I'm adding half cup of water so the guava done blend now I'm gonna just strain off you know guys I'm straining off the guava now to get the juice out of it to add into the barbecue to make the, so it's gonna be a guava barbecue sauce guys can you see the guava it, it is thick because I don't want to have too much water in it so that's why I use half cup of water so even when it, it blend out it still would have half the body which is the thickness I am going to add some ketchup into the blended guava so I'm currently gonna make the sauce for the chicken and I'm adding one spoon of brown sugar I'm adding some chopped onion a small chop on here and I'm gonna pour my barbecue sauce and I'm gonna mix my barbecue so this is my guava barbecue fried chicken sauce guys so we are tasting the sauce and guys I'm not So guys, I'm adding some green pepper in it as well. And I'm not adding any honey because the sauce is a spicy honey barbecue sauce. So I'm just going to taste it one more time. tasting real good so 
I am going to add one tablespoon of fish and meat sauce. Add in some more spice and flavor in to the sauce. Sauce rich and pretty. So I am going to add the barbecue sauce over the chicken. So I'm just pouring it over the chicken. You guys can you see that? Barbecue sauce looking good. Chicken is ready for the oven. Guys, the oven. I heat up you now, so check on it. Oh. Put in the barbecue in here now for uh, 10 minutes. Just for it to get a little bit more color and the barbecue sauce to dry on a little bit more. Guys, I'm gonna use one and a half pack of macaroni. So add in the first pack. I'm going to throw some out of this. I'm not going to cook the entire two pork. Right, I'm checking on the chicken in the meantime. Coming around good guys. So we are going to turn on the stove for low. So for the macaroni and cheese, I'm going to use some milk. And two spoon of butter. So I'm adding the cheese. And I'm adding some onion. Guys, so I am going to put the macaroni and cheese into the oven. I go over barbecue fried chicken and my macaroni and cheese. If you like this video, Please give this video a thumbs up and if you are new to my channel please consider subscribing 